guys, how's it going? It's a beautiful day. It's kind of foggy out. I don't know if you can tell from behind me. I like you can see a little bit, but then there's a bank of fog and it's just really beautiful. It's not even that cold out, which makes it very pleasant. Uh, anyway, my mom and I are going to be heading over to Boise to do some shopping. My mom uh, wants to find some, uh, we'll ask her what she's looking for. I know some light fixtures and things. We're both working on sheds at the moment. I found a chandelier for mine last time. Um, she's hoping to find one for hers this time. We both need exterior lighting for it and then just general stuff, um, you know, chairs and maybe some table work tables things like that but i saw something advertised an event called the treasure valley flea market i know nothing about it but the picture that they used to advertise showed what looked like antiques uh, it might be just a mix of a whole bunch of different things and it's like a a bigger event uh, so i'm expecting maybe several vendors i don't know we're gonna go check it out so we thought we would take you guys along since it's going to be a little bit different than our normal shopping trips. It's already ready to roll. <laughs> <laughs> I I have comfortable shoes on. Oh, nice. What kind of shoes do you have on? Oh. Comfortable ones. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. With laces and everything and they no look, holes. They look so you are looking for a chandelier, yes. exterior lighting as am, am I. Are you just needing one light for just the outside? Just one light for the outside. And I need a pair. Oh, okay. So just okay. to, and I need them to kind of match the house. I don't know if you're. Uh, yep you're going for kind of the same like mm -hmm. cohesion well maybe some, some yeah okay. i mean just yeah. to get like so i can be looking yeah and then general stuff tables yes. chairs yes just like everything <laughs> all the things you can I, give me some of your old stuff well that's an idea <laughs> <laughs> make room for some new stuff i don't know how the the road is going to be exactly with the mm -hmm. fog because mom on the way in so she comes the opposite direction um, that we're going uh, and it was mm -hmm. like pea soup it was really thick so really hopefully bad. it's kind of clearing up as we get toward Boise it typically does yeah a little bit so yeah. anyway we are gonna stop and get coffee of course and then we will head over and we'll see you guys there okay we have just arrived at the Expo Idaho it looks like they're actually setting up a huge Christmas light display over here I wonder if I can show you guys there's a huge parking lot though as you can see over there somebody's got a lift and they're putting lights on a massive tree. It looks to be really busy though. This is just a two day event. And today is Saturday and it goes nine to five. And right now it is 1049. And there were lots of people coming out and lots of people going in. So this is fun. I really hope we find some good stuff. Also, there was a moment or two on the way over here just outside of Ontario where it was socked in with fog. And I was like, I don't like driving in the fog. It makes me feel like I have vertigo. Um, and it's beautiful and sunny over here, so we're soaking it in. Oh, it's so pretty. Oh, there might be food. That would be real fun if there was food. Yeah, <laughs> let's have lunch here if there's food. That says Bistro Babe on that food truck over there. Oh, yeah, there so is. So there's a senior lifestyle expo today, too, and then the flea market's here. Perfect, thank you. Yeah, you too. Okay, let me give you guys a general feel here. It looks like just a ton of booths in this space oh my goodness oh benjamin and samantha would like this display that's a pretty mirror right there you have room for another mirror oh yeah, yeah. i and always that, have room for mirrors and that's a good price yeah it is i always love stuff that looks like this too i think that's really pretty there's a traffic light mom <laughs> we need that in our lives somewhere we do yeah i like this I always like those things yeah. that have baskets in them, yeah. like for an entryway yeah. or something. Or my potty shed. Yeah, or the studio or the cut flower yeah. shed. <laughs> wouldn't that be wouldn't that be cute? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, look at this. It, Mom, I need this. Real smoke, turning wheels, animated figures. Oh, that's awesome. Look at this. Those are lights. Are you oh. you've got to be kidding me? <laughs> Okay. You need These are giant. Your light. We've got to have these. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. Look, Santa's marching band. They're lights. Oh, oh, how sweet oh. is that? Yeah, isn't that cool? Oh, can you imagine? Oh. It goes ding, ding, ding oh. on those bells. And you would love the sounds. Brass bells and You'd it plays like 36 all the, all the Christmas noise. carols. <laughs> Watch them play. Oh, that is so cool. I need to turn this on because if it if it's not a good sound, I don't think I'd want to have it. Well, the guy is right over here. You probably ask him. Okay, I don't know what 
pretty noisy in here, but. Oh, I love it. That's awesome. Oh, I love <laughs> yeah. it. Yeah, you gotta have Yay. it. <laughs> the food so we're gonna share a pretzel and some drinks back here before we head back out <laughs> maybe I'm just in a real good mood but it seems like everybody here is in a real good mood <laughs> everybody's having a really good time <laughs> that gentleman that helped us super sweet super nice mm -hmm. how's that treating you mm. so, so good, good. Huh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay we've had our snack so we're ready to attack again I do think we're gonna go out to the Antique World Mall because this doesn't feel as much like antiques uh -uh. as just like a flea market, mm -hmm. which there's some fun things, but definitely not like light fixtures no. like we're looking for. Right. Okay, we're headed back to the car now. So we made our rounds through the flea market. That was really fun. Something different to do. So we'll probably head to Enchanting Objects next. We just arrived at Enchanting Objects and it's busy. Like we barely got a parking yeah. spot. They have some kind of event going on. I'm not sure what it is. Oh, that's pretty. I like I that. It's super pretty, yeah. isn't it? see chairs like this in my bedroom because they're very straight up and oh, down. Yeah. yeah. I like that set though. I put that set somewhere. Is it comfy? Yeah. <laughs> Even with the wreath? I love those. Yeah. yeah. Look at these urns. Oh my goodness. Oh, those are gorgeous. They're pretty. Yeah. Now these, Laura, should go in the Hartley. These are pretty. Yeah, those are pretty. It's pretty, isn't it? Yeah. These are I love are these the legs. Drawers? No. They something I moves. I really here. like that though. Yeah. We're gonna have to rock, paper, scissors. No, no, you <laughs> you've got it. Yeah, look at this. Look at the yeah. legs. Yeah, it's super pretty. It's really beautiful. This is a cute mirror, Mom. Look at this one. Yes, it is. Here's a sheet picture. Oh, I like the frame and everything on that. Yeah, isn't that cute? Yeah, very. That's a sweet picture. There's always so much to see here, and I think there's extra here because like of the that event. Bistro. Look at the oh, little that bistro. Oh, that is really cute. Those look like the chairs I bought with the bistro that's in my back sun porch. Yeah? Mm hmm. Wouldn't this be cute in my little yeah. potting oh, shed? Yeah, it would be the perfect size. Yeah. That's not bad. No. I mean, it's un unlevel ground, but these are not. Yeah, I like the base. How a much lot. is it? Um, right here. $265. 265. Yeah, that's really cute. It is cute and it would be perfect in there, wouldn't it? Mm -hmm. I like the cushions and everything. Yeah. They're in not bad shape. Mm -mm. You take the tack off of it? I think so. Okay. Don't you think this is perfect? Yeah, I do think it's perfect. Yeah. It's a perfect scale. Yes. Isn't that beautiful? Yeah. Oh, and it's on sale. 45. That's gorgeous though. That is really pretty. So yeah. is that mirror. Yeah. Okay, well I gotta go get my purse two chairs, two tables, and a lamp later. So it doesn't get scratched. Thank you. All right guys, we're making a stop at Edwards Greenhouse next. So I don't think we've ever brought you guys down here. We stop here every once in a while and they do like an indoor park in the winter time uh, where they've got grass and everything and families come down and throw out blankets. It's really kind of a neat deal. Oh, look at all the house plants, you guys. So this whole area in here, it's all heated. It's all undercover. Look how pretty oh, it is. Oh, look at the points that is. Yeah. Oh. There they are, there they are. I wonder which ones are ours. Look in there. Oh my goodness. A sea of goodness. poinsettias. <gasps> we need to get in there. The violas are really sweet. Aren't they? Since the garden center has a bunch of these on order, uh, we did ask if we could come in here and take a look and they were more than happy to let yeah. us be on the employees mm -hmm. only sign. Look at this one. Christmas rose. Yes. Yeah. It's just so gorgeous. Look at these. Yeah. Massive. They're like huge. Yeah. Just look at that sea of color, you guys. Yeah. This is a treat. 
and it just goes on and on. And look at My even these goodness. little baby pink ones. Yeah, those are really sweet. Those little tiny ones are just nice, like to put in the bathroom yeah. or on, you know, nestle in little, somewhere. Yeah, mm -hmm. just nestle yeah. them in. Nestle them into Christmas yeah. greens. Can you guys imagine growing things on this scale? I can't. I, I can't even imagine, like, can you imagine the responsibility? Like, I think I would be so stressed out. Mm -hmm. But, you know, these people, they have it on, obviously, a mm -hmm. like a schedule, and they've got it down to a science mm -hmm. because they look so beautiful and healthy. There's, yeah. like, not a yellow leaf on anything no. in here. Look at that color, that blushy color. Oh, I think that's yeah. gorgeous. Yes, that is so pretty. It's like the peach, peachy pink. And look at I that. like... It looks more antique. It, it looks really antique, yeah. like patinaed. Yeah. But see how the leaves are moving. I mean, they have to know that Airflow. they need a little bit of yep. like movement to make Otherwise, them strong. Otherwise, spider mites. Spider mites and weak stems. Mm -hmm. Just amazing. That's Monica's favorite, everybody. It Every is. year she has one of those in her house. Oh, look at all their amaryllis, honey. They've got them potted up. Oh my, yeah, lots of amaryllis in Yeah. There. Look at the size of that ficus. Cute fairy garden thing. Yeah, they usually have a pretty good selection here, fairy garden. Ours is almost sold out. Is it really? Yeah. Oh, look at this. They've got a cute display here. This is a good way to display them because these things are hard to display. Yeah, they are. That's it's a great little, way. Yeah, I, I need like to look that. for one of those at an yeah, antique yeah. store. Yeah, keep your eyeballs open, yep. Laura. I will. That's pretty. A double pink and white. <gasps> Ooh, look at this. Harlequin, that's gorgeous. Oh my goodness. So there's some big ficus. Look at how gorgeous these are. What variety is this? Altissima, beautiful, beautiful orchid. Oh, is this a tongue tickler? Spilanthus, yes it is. This is that weird thing that if you eat the bloom or the leaf, it makes your mouth feel numb. See if I can get my mom to do it. <laughs> Ooh, I like these. This plant is called the tongue tickler. Oh, that's yeah. the one. I know. You got me to do that one time. I did. I yes, did. you did. Don't you dare. <laughs> that's like you eating the olive uncured. Uh, oh. <laughs> When did Look, I have you do that? Oh, I, have oh, I to know. Have I just, these. I just looked at those. Stopped and looked at oh, them. Oh, yeah. Aren't they beautiful? They are so pretty. <gasps> oh, that color, Laura. This color we love. It's really pretty. So is that like creamy one over there? Yes. Mm -hmm. Oh, I can't wait for spring. You could have when some of these that. in a bowl on somewhere. Yeah, in your but house. I, I'm, I'm gearing up to do you know white and red and yeah. stuff like that. I'm gonna walk, uh, well, I guess down this way. I like these um, obelisks over here, the twig ones. Aren't those pretty? Yeah. Yeah. Got some pretty succulents. Yes. Holy moly, there's so many. There's a really pretty green wall over there. Look at this jade, all in bloom. You don't see yeah. this too often. No. Them all in bloom like that, that's super pretty. These are pretty, look at yeah. that. Yeah. Oh, there's some pretty things over here. Come look, whoa. Those are the biggest pine cones ever. Oh, yeah. you're doing a great job. Yeah, Looks really, really pretty. cute and pretty. Little Norfolk pine, pines, yeah. you just don't see those too no. often. No, I think we should get some, I need some. Cute. Yeah. Really cute. Probably need to get like three of them. Yeah. At least. With some of those begonias. Yeah, well maybe in a, in a bowl garden. That wouldn't, be that be, pretty. wouldn't that be pretty? That I like that. Yeah, that's real pretty. Remember, I, I think looks, we had these, Laura. I we had those. I have the love yeah. seat. I'm like, oh yeah, that is yeah. pretty. Because I have it. <laughs> Where's, where is it at? It's by the butterfly garden. Oh, I like this. Yeah. Look at this. Oh yeah, that's cool. I like that. Mm -hmm. Louis. Oh, it's so cute. Yeah, that is really cute. Look at. Oh my, yeah. Oh, there's a couple of Louis. Yeah. How funny is that? So as you look out back here in season, they have like just tons of trees. You can see some of them back in there. Tons of trees and shrubs and perennials and it goes all the way back. Like there are greenhouses all the way in this whole section, like everything over here and back in here is just floated with plants. <laughs> oh, that's cute. <laughs> Isn't that? Yes. That oh. looks very Hartley-esque. Um, no, <laughs> no, it could be right. that's your potting shed. Yes, the potting shed. 
I actually think Louie would be cute in yeah, the potting shed. Yeah, on the potting shed. A little bit more look. small scale, possibly. Okay, I think that I've got what I need. Need. <laughs> <laughs> Me too. You've got your violets? Yeah. Let's go check out and go okay. have some lunch. Yes, let's do it. I like these candle holder steaks. Are we gonna go eat Thai? Maybe. Doesn't that sound kind of good? Sounds super good. Okay, <laughs> so now that I've worked a thorough sweat up, <laughs> rearranging things in this car because, well, you know, mercy. <laughs> We're gonna go have some lunch. Well, we decided against Thai food because it was so far. The restaurant we like is so far away. And on I the other side of town. You want a cocktail? Do they of have cocktails here? Yes. This is one of our favorite restaurants, like going way back. It's tucked right at the base of the mountains. So the mountains started in this way. And we've been coming here for pff, years. Yeah. As long as I can remember. Yeah, long time. This is what I get every time. It's kind of like a ski hangout. There's Bogus Basin, which is a ski resort really close by. Um, so you see a bunch of skiers here after their yeah. long day of skiing. Yeah. We used to go to Brundage skiing as kids, mm -hmm. which is in out of McCall, Idaho. So this right here is peppered steak on soba noodles. I've already kind of started in, so it's not looking as pretty. And mom gets grilled polenta. Oh, so good. I'm super excited to be eating this. It has been a little while since I've been here. Like probably a couple, a year? Maybe this time last year, I think. Yeah, so anyway, see you guys in a little bit. Oh my goodness, you guys, look at the back of our truck. <laughs> look at this, look at those chairs, aren't they awesome? I know you can't see them super well right now, but there are cushions that go here. Um, and then this table, the console table for the cut flower shed. And then we've got another dresser here, which will probably go inside our house. And then we've got the bistro set in here, <laughs> along with plants and chandeliers. Yes. We still have a little bit of room. We do, we've got several square feet. Yes, here. and in the back underneath the uh, yeah, we've got, console. We've got, we've got some things to do. <laughs> My goodness, it's been a productive day. So the last time we came out here, we came home with a handful of things, yeah. but nothing like today. So anyway, we're gonna go hit the village before we go home. Yes. We'll probably get a drink there um, for the drive home, and yep. then we'll attempt to get this thing unloaded. They didn't oh. believe me that I could fit all the furniture in there. They don't know us. They don't know us at all. Nope. Okay, so we've got our Mexican mochas, and we're gonna sit here by the fountain because it's so beautiful. We didn't show a lot of the stops here in the village because they contained a lot of Christmas presents. So you guys know, like we have to keep it on under wraps this time of year. So we're just gonna sit and enjoy, and then when we get home, we'll line everything out and show you what we got. dark out here but we've got everything out of the truck so we're gonna give you a little tour of what we ended up with I'm surprised now that I see everything that everything fit in the truck are you Erin <laughs> you did good <laughs> okay we'll just start right here this is the bistro set that mom picked up I think it's gonna be perfect in the potting shed mom yes it's gonna be awesome <laughs> what do you think Miss Samantha Grace <laughs> Sit in my Christmas blanket. Yeah. Here's the dresser. I'm really excited about this one. I like the handles, the way those look. I like the detail on the front. I think this will be perfect. You got gum for everyone. Yeah. That's awesome. Here's the console table. Isn't the base of this the coolest thing? These look like trophies or something. Or urn well, they look like urns. Urns? Trophies? Yes. Thank you. They're pretty awesome. Oh, they're beautiful. I do think I'm gonna uh, rub this whole thing down with Danish oil and that will deepen up the color and make it look a little bit more finished. On the tabletop, mom's uh, African violets. I picked up this lamp. This is so pretty. It is pretty. Yeah. I love this kind of green right here. Is, yes. is there a name for that? I Are don't know. Are you gifting that to me? <laughs> do you want me to <laughs> give that to you? Christmas is just around the corner. Yes, <laughs> but I love this detail yeah. on the top. I need to get so a shade pretty. for it. Yeah. There are the two wingback chairs. Have you sat in those yet, Erin? No, I haven't. Oh, it's Where looking darker. 
Well, I was thinking either the front sun porch where the chaise is or the oh, cut flower yeah. shed. So I don't know. I really like the, the way they're shaped a lot because we have a lot of areas where we can tuck smaller things in like this. I do think I'm going to either probably not paint the wood, but probably stain it a different, like a little bit deeper. But I don't know. We'll see. And these are reversible. So you can do your cushion like that if you want. Of course, I need to get pillows for the back. Um, at the flea market, here are the John Deere Christmas lights that I picked up. My mom's Santa's marching band. That was so cool. I can't wait to show the kids here in a minute. It's going to be so fun. Yeah, we're going to plug that in inside in, in just a second. And I think Benjamin's going to love it. And then last but not least on the tailgate here, mom's two chandeliers for the her potting shed. So this, these will be so neat. I got three amaryllis bulbs right here and then just an assortment of plants. I've got some Norfolk pines, some begonias, cyclamen, little spider plants. And I think that that about does it. Aren't those comfortable chairs? Oh, they're super comfortable. Yeah. Now I sat with the, it had like lumbar pillow yeah. in there and I think that's probably needed, but I really like, love them. And that is it for today's video. What a fun day going over and doing some different things, you know, trying out that flea market, even though it wasn't a wild success, like finding a lot of things there, it felt festive. People were in such a, like a good mood and just happy to be there. Uh, and then finding these little vintagey things for the Christmas trees is really fun. And then stopping in at Edwards just to see some plants and be in the warm greenhouses that always kind of fills me up. So anyway, super successful day. Not every time do we go, do we end up with this much in our truck. Um, but this is how we like to fill up our homes. We like to go and find things that just speak to us and things that are a little bit more unique and not just running down to a furniture store and picking up whatever's there, you know, which there's nothing wrong with that. I have pieces like that in my house too, but I do like to just kind of hand pick. It takes a lot longer. It takes being able to break away and be able to go do that in order to get that kind of look. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you're having a great day and we will see you in the next video. Bye. And here are the John Deere lights. They're so cute. I can't wait to drape something in Benjamin's room with these. Look at that. Their heads when they go. Like there's a little light right here.